in our Iltatech survey of last year, 60% of uh, the, the firms um, cited a increase of security or an enhancement of security as a reason to move to the cloud. So this is again speaking to that confidence of um, uh, cloud being able to address the, those security concerns, as you just uh, mentioned there, Brett, with the, the infrastructure spend that, that cloud platforms are sitting on. Uh, it's something that an individual law firm just cannot compete with uh, in that kind of reg in that regard. Um, we know that the um, amount globally that is spent annually is looking to increase uh, to uh, $260 billion uh, in 2026, uh, and last year it was just $160 billion. So um, we are seeing that annual spend uh, almost double in, in the next couple of years uh, as we move forward. And that is only because of the increased nature and, and frequency of data breaches that we are forecasting. They're not slowing down, they, they're coming, and obviously, you know, there has to be some kind of investment to, to protect against that. 80% of data breaches do stem from compromised credentials, so certainly a concern or consideration around governance and controlling uh, those kinds of, of things, which we'll speak to on our next slide uh, around uh, data sprawl and account sprawl. Um, the average number of, of days to detect a data breach is just under 10 months. So that is 10 months after the data breach has occurred, we're only finding out about it on average. And those data breaches are costing us an average of just over $4 million per breach uh, last year. And of course, last year, the number in the US alone was just under 2,000, 1,800 data breaches just last year. And again, we're gonna see that increase.